This clip is brought to you by BattleOnline.com. That's his. That's his thing. I don't. I don't have nothing to do with that. I'm yeah. I, 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 words are real big with me, and word regime is not something I want to be involved. You know. Okay. Yeah, rest in peace to so, um I know we recently heard of the passing of um Gonzo. I don't know if you had any um... yeah, I, knew, I knew Gonzo, you know, I knew him throughout the industry and he used to be with Yuck a lot and, you know, be around, see him in the club and shit when I lived in LA, but I didn't I didn't know no Gonzo like that. I, I couldn't I can call Gonzo a friend, but he's a little I mean, uh, what do you think of just um like a lot of the deaths and stuff that we've seen in hip hop recently, even with a lot of the new generation artists and stuff, um, do you think that a lot of the, I guess the street culture that leaks into the music from the night is, has had an effect on what we see now with the younger generation? Man, I can't even, I can't tell you what what is going. Oh yes, I can. The generation right now, man, it's it's not it's not what we were. In the nineties, at all. I mean, the 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 music, the music right now. I don't know. I guess it comes from a I don't give a fuck type of thing with them. You know what I mean? Because I mean, now this generation, it seems like they have no morals. They don't give a fuck about shit. It's like they wasn't even raised with parents. And you know what? That's probably our generation's fault. You know what I mean? We was wild our goddamn selves, but. We cared about something, you know what I mean? We, especially when it came to our music, we had we, we we had subjects. We talked about something, you know what I mean? Nowadays, I don't know what the fuck is going on. I can't say everything is garbage. There's some good stuff, but I mean, damn, the majority is just like, what is that shit? And the record industry is so fucked up. They they just putting all this shit out. If you if you want to talk about killing your own people. Doing drugs, disrespecting women, you can you can basically be famous today. Now, not to say that that we didn't do all of that stuff when we were coming up, because we did, but it was done in a different way, man. It's, I guess it wasn't all that. You know what I mean? We had a lot of it, yes, but it wasn't all that. We had subject matter. Nowadays, it's all that, man. And it's like, damn, y'all don't have shit else to talk about. Which really makes it it's sad because that's that where we going our whole our whole everything the whole rap thing that's where it's going that's where that's where it's at that's all we have it's really messed up man uh, yeah. and they gonna mean, keep putting it out there they gonna they gonna keep putting it out there because they want our kids to follow that shit that's how they want they want our kids to be like that. Do you feel as though the industry has more politically sort of tied the voice of artists nowadays where they're not as free to express themselves without, um, you know, extra sort of repercussions? Man. Yeah, I can agree with that. I can agree with that. You know, I think it all comes back to how they want us as black people to be. I mean, white kids listen to rap, yes, of course. But the black generation is the ones who go to jail over it, who gets killed over it, shit like that. And they want this. So, yes, it's political. And, yes, it's an agenda against blacks. Yes, it is. Definitely. Peace, family. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and check us out on BoutTheOnline.com. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook for exclusive playlists and social media for all different types of segments and content.